We need to maintain what is our own truth. We need to be authentic. And once people see that we come from an honest place, there's really nothing that can stop a woman. Did you ever imagine that you would be chairman and CEO of the world's largest toy company? Absolutely not. I just wanted to be the best that I could be. And when you do that, you automatically do the job that's above you. My first product was called a bad case of worms. And when you threw them against the wall, they would slither down. Well, that's what they were meant to do, but they didn't necessarily do that. So with the help of my father, who was a television director, I had him shoot a stop action um, film, literally, where they were crawling down beautifully. Management, who was in the room watching, um, said to themselves, wait a minute, we have someone here who did something and was able to make a success out of something that seemed like it could never be. Up until that point, every little girl in America, 14 million little girls, owned one Barbie doll and then lots of clothes. So I was charged with how to create multiple purchase. And that's how the campaign of We Girls Can Do Anything happened and it changed the total trajectory of Barbie, I think forever. Tell me about We Girls. We did research that basically said that 80% of moms thought Barbie was a very poor role model. After we ran We Girls, um, changed to 90% of moms thinking that she was a very positive role model. I wanted girls and mothers to be able to look at her and say, wait, she made my child believe that she could accomplish this. And to me, I mean, there is no greater purpose on this earth as a woman than to achieve that goal, and, and we did. What are you most proud of? I would say that, you know, it's even outside of what I did in the business and the brands. And it was helping to create the Mattel Children's Hospital. To me, there was no place on the planet that was leaving a legacy for Mattel. And to this day, Mattel supports that hospital and every Mattel employee volunteers there and spends time with all those children. I truly believe that being a girl is not a detriment in business. And um, I'm gonna work very, very hard to see if I can do something to help make a change. Because I really believe if women joined together, not only would they be an unbeatable force, they'd be a force for good.